Hey friends, so this is week one of Raw Not So Raw Vegan. Um, here's my little shopping list really quickly. Um, this week I did allow myself some cheating because certain things just didn't dawn on me until after I did it or after I ordered it. Um, like, you know, you have to think about your sauces, your cheeses, all, all these types of things you have to think, is it vegan? And most times it's not. And also at dinner time, I cook my dinner. I like warm dinner. So that's that, but it's a learning process. It's my first week, so stay tuned. So let's give it a try and see how it tastes before I mix with everything else. So. Mmm, that's real good and flavorful. And the aroma smells so good. You would have thought this was real sausage. So this needs absolutely no seasoning at all. It tastes so good. Like it's already seasoned and spicy. It tastes so good. So I'm about to saute these a little bit. I did mess up on my rice. Um, first time cooking chickpea rice. So I am going to fry it a little bit to try to dry it up and see if that helps. And then over here, as you see, everything's coming together. I am... I do want a little bit more broth and I'm up in the air about if I want to add this cream or mushroom to it but this alone I would eat it looks so delicious actually let's try it together let me eat a little bit of everything let's see mm -mm -mm. that's so good mm. I didn't cook the onions too long with that garlic and the spinach Oh my goodness. Mmm. Yeah. I can eat that alone. So this might be a fail. Um, I did saute the green onions a little bit. Um, I sauteed the rice a little bit with the green onions to try to, you know, dry it out some. Let's see. Okay. It's not bad. Um, let's see. The cream and mushroom really helped out a lot. It's like I kind of like it, but let's add it together and let's see. That tastes really good together. Mm, that sausage really brings out the cream and mushroom flavor. Mm. So this is going to be the bottom. I really like that it's creamy because I really like creamy things. It tastes really good, actually. I'm really surprised because, like I said, I messed that rice up. So the texture is not what I expected out of the rice, but the creaminess is actually perfect. It's not what I expected, not what I want, but it works.